Hey everybody, this is Troy from the Do-It-Yourself World Electronics. I have a bit of a problem. Uh, wonderful Windows 10 did a forced update on me again, destroying my miners. I have a uh, five rig machine. Only four cards are running because one of my um, adapters is dead. So I have to get another one on there. But it was running at a hundred mega hash on ethereum and now after the update i'm down to 32 32 33 mega hash i was getting that much per card and now i'm getting eight per card so windows purged my i have so much hate microsoft windows 10 windows purged my drivers i'm getting a total of 904 megahertz per card right now and so I have to reinstall my drivers to get my speed back up otherwise it's useless this is actually serving dual purpose here this is heating our bedroom and mining ethereum so instead of running an electric heater which just uses electricity for nothing no gain except for well I mean you got your heat with this I heat a room and get paid to do it there's some profit at the end of the month when it's running at full power and I'm hardly getting any shares it's just ridiculous so I have to reinstall the drivers let me um, close this out and uh, open up my driver file I'll be back in a minute so I've got the uh, crimson um, re is it crimson relive beta Radian software I have to reinstall and hopefully that's going to do the job for me so uh, with space recorded 800 megs that's a big file so I'll let that run for a little bit that's going to be um, take a little bit of time well maybe not it's not a bad computer actually this rig um, I think yeah I got the Biostar mining this is the uh, TB250 BTC mining motherboard. Looks like I need a dusting in here. I'm going to have to get the air compressor in here and dust it off. It's uh, been on here for a couple weeks. Heating our room. It keeps it a nice, happy 70 degrees with that going. So, no matter what the weather. Actually, we have to open the windows sometimes in here to let out some of the heat. So, that makes a great... Um, heater that pays its own self in a way all right we'll be back in a minute and see what let this work you got the license agreement checking for updates I don't think there were any updates as far as I know that was uh, um, beta back in 2017 local driver recommended driver I guess I'm going to go with a recommended driver. Downloading the installer updater. Eh, we'll see if there are any new updates since then. I've been using it off the hard drive for years and I have never seen any updates. Eh, we'll see what we got. Oh, I missed it. Radian. I was throwing Radian Adrenaline 2020 edition. I guess they're just showing me ads now while it installs. Time remaining 10 minutes, 0% installed. I guess I'll be back after a while. Oh, Windows. So I found out that I had an offline miner. I get an email from, um, I think it's ethermine.org that I use. And I got an email that I had an offline rig. So I... Uh, came in here and checked and sure enough it was waiting for my response because it did a major update and then I had to sit here and bear through it while it updated software I, I don't like also that Windows downloads the updates against your will installs the updates against your will and then sits there and waits for you to reply to let you know that it did what it was going to do anyway meanwhile your computer is not performing any work until the next time you happen to come around and uh, accept what you didn't really want to have happen in the first place 
And then you can start using your computer again. So I'm going to learn how to use Linux for mining one day soon here for stability. I have a Linux laptop that I've never ever had it give me any trouble at all as long as I've used it for the last couple years. And it only does what I want when I want. So I've got to learn how to mine with Linux. That'll be a big deal. That'll help a lot. But having your um, computer set up to automatically boot up and load your mining software is no good at all when Windows does a major forced update and then stops waiting for you until you click on something to agree that something that you didn't want in the first place and then it installs the updates some more and uh, finally you get control of your computer again. So it's going to be nine and a half minutes more. I'll be back in a while. Well that's a problem. Some of the software applications failed to correctly uninstall. I have to start over. That's not cool. I have to download the AMD cleanup utility and run it to clean up any corrupted files because Microsoft sort of made a mess of my computer. Uh, I have to run it in safe mode. That's odd. Well, I have to restart in safe mode and uh, run the cleanup utility. Well, that didn't work. Um, we have life, I hope. Okay, I put it on the motherboard. I was always running on the graphic card. Finally! Alright, we'll try it again. I'm going to see if I can run that AMD uh, cleanup program. Oh, uh, wait. It looked like it was going into safe mode. Windows, 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 Windows. Yeah. Hope and learning. Odd. Alright, let me see if I can figure out what's going on. It did boot up into safe mode. I can run the AMD cleanup. I reset the computer three, four times, actually. I'm surprised it still went into safe mode. So I'll run the AMD uh, software cleanup utility. Notice my voice changed. I'm feeling better that the computer is alive. I've lost a lot of computers due to uh, Microsoft updates in the past. That was a year or so ago, back in the day when, was it almost two years ago now, uh, Microsoft was breaking computers and they knew about it. I just have panic attacks thinking back on that day. Uh, has completed with warnings. What warnings? I'm going to have to look at this. Rebooting computer? I should probably use the motherboard anyway. I'm going to have to go into BIOS later and use the motherboard graphics and leave the uh, um, graphic cards to just do their work. When you plug in a graphic card to uh, Windows, to the monitor, Windows takes some of its RAM to uh, run a little file in there to run the graphics on it. So I'll probably just use the motherboard from now on anyway. All right, well, let me see if I can reinstall. I'll let this give it a time to finish booting and see if I can reinstall the uh, AMD drivers. We'll be back in a few minutes and see how it goes. Meanwhile, I'm embarrassed. I said USB adapter. That's a riser card. Oh, yuck. Well, that's what happens when you work at night and haven't had coffee in a while. USB adapter. Pfft. Well... Uh, it says it's installing, but that's how far we got earlier, so we'll see what happens. Hope it goes through this time. I want to get this miner going, because it's getting cold. This is my heater and my money maker. Looking good. Alright, it wants me to restart. I hope this is going to work out well. We'll see how it turns out. Well, my card's kicked in. Oh, the wrong miner opened up. Let me see. Get MSI Afterburner opened up. I'm left-handed, by the way. Um, 300 and 300. Well, that's not exactly good. Uh, I gotta check my details here. Okay, I started my miner, and it bumped up. Oh, it dropped back to 904 in 2000. Hmm, interesting. 
Well, it's moving. At least it's fluctuating. And we're back. We are back in business. 100 megahertz. Mega hash. Blah! I need my coffee. 100 mega hash total speed. We are back in business. So, when Microsoft nukes your computer by installing updates in uh, your mining rig, I should say, and you lose a considerable hash rate. Mine went down to 25% of its previous hash rate. When you lose considerable, uh, 30%. When you lose considerable hash rate, uh, that means that you have to reinstall your drivers. I had to install the graphic card mining drivers. Back in business, getting shares, looking good. And I'm going to have heat again tonight. Good. Well, guys, thanks for watching. This is Troy from the Do It Yourself World Electronics. A happy, successful evening of work. Please like, subscribe, and share, and follow my exciting videos in alternate energy, electronics, and cryptocurrency mining, and anything else I deal with that comes along. And hit that uh, bell icon to get notifications of uploads. Talk to you later.